all my recent mic reviews. I've, I feel like I'm saving one of the best for last. I'm really excited to show you guys because this is going to be a mic that I'm gonna be getting a lot of use out of on this channel. What's up YouTube, it's your boy Second Born, Berkeley graduated, sound gym validated. Today we are looking at Jay-Z Microphones V12. So let's open it up, take a look. Second Born Music. Red. This is Jay-Z Microphones recently updated Vintage 12. It's a double large diaphragm condenser microphone. It's Jay-Z Microphones take on the legendary AKG C12. It's handcrafted and tested in Latvia with class A discreet electronics. Featuring its unique golden drop capsule technology for clarity, precision, and a clean frequency response for little to no coloration or distortion. All components are hand soldered with a cardioid puller pickup pattern and a frequency response of 20 hertz, 20 kilohertz, and a very low noise level of 6 dB average, and it comes with a five-year warranty. And you can pick one up now for $8.99 US. Tell me what you're drinking, cause this is unacceptable, are you crazy? You've been saying real weird shh, like da-da-da-da, you're not making sense no more. Saying things like da 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 da, this is unacceptable. The Jay Z Mike's Vintage V12, modeled after the AKG C12, which is a legendary vocal microphone. You can see that huge, that one inch diaphragm capsule capturing every bit of detail and nuance in your source. Hand soldered components built in Latvia. <laughs> And if you've been watching my channel, we've, we've all learned together the quality that comes out of Latvia when it comes to audio. That's a fact. Throw up a 100 emoji right there. Thank you. So hand built and tested in Latvia. Cool design, hole at the bottom here. Not sure if that adds anything sonically. One of the things that I found that I love the most is this rotatable mount at the bottom here. And I, I, have, it in, I have it in there pretty tight. Hold on. That's what she said. <laughs> Can't get it out. That's what he said. Can't get it out. Can't get it out. Help. There we go. Just needed some love. So right at the bottom, a little ball joint screw in for the mount. So you can screw it in and then you can rotate. It's so handy and it's something that we all take for granted. That's almost a must have feature for a desktop setup if you have a boom arm on your desktop like I have. That huge one inch suspended capsule in the middle, very large net to capture your sound. So much so that they ship it with a little pin holding that capsule in place because it's so large and you want it shifting around in there, I assumedly. Has a nice brushed stone finish. You can feel the texture on there. And you got the gold face logo on the front. Put it all together in a nice package. They took all of the sonic qualities that make the C12 great. They removed the tubes, which can be problematic over time. They've replaced tubes with transistors and class A discrete. Uh, electronics. So it has all the same sonic qualities and characteristics of a vintage microphone without all the problems. And the microphone in theory should last a lot longer. Treat her nicely, you know. Juris Zarens, the founder of Jay-Z Microphones, he introduced the golden drop technology that's found on the capsule. So in short, and, and I don't know what I'm talking about entirely, but they're using gold to ensure a light diaphragm. It helps with the conduction of electricity. And instead of using thick layers of gold, to achieve this, like some other companies do, they use a sputtering technique. Spitting the gold on there to keep the capsule as light as possible. Making the capsule lighter, faster, able to capture more detail because it can move faster. It gives me a bit of a headache if I think about it too much. <laughs> I'm just trying to, you know, just trying to explain it to you, give you a little bit of, trying to give you a little bit of backstory on it, okay? I'm no expert on this stuff, but I can tell you, it's easy to tell the difference in which mics sound better when they're offering similar features, similar frequency ranges, and recording similar things. And this is one of the mics that sounds better 
in these scenarios. Maybe we attribute that to the golden drop technology. Probably, I don't know. I don't, I just don't know, all right? It sounds good, it sounds better than others. I might I might do a video where I rank all of the microphones. Let me know in the comments. It sounds better out of the box without needing to do any EQ to massage it, to make it fit in better. It's just a ready to go kind of sound. I recorded my Truth About My Channel video using just this microphone because it's that, it's that good. It will likely be my primary voiceover microphone. And that said, let's get it to the desk. Oh my, oh my, oh my, my, my. How gorgeous are you? Oh yeah. You gotta love the rotatable mount. So I have it mounted on the desk here. I don't believe I'm too loud. I'm not clipping anywhere. Let me see, hold on. So I have it mounted on the desk here so you can hear how it sounds. Like I said, I did an entire video using just this microphone. So if you want an extended version, uh, Recommend checking out that video. Again, that feature, that rotatable head feature comes into play big time because I could just move this around just as I needed to. Okay, all right. I can hang it upside down. I can hang it upside down. However I'd like to, however I'd like to mount it and set it up, I can do that. So, excellent design for a desktop microphone and it sounds amazing for voiceover work. So if this is kind of a setup that you do, if you use it for gaming, you can use it for, for voiceover work, you can use it for podcast broadcasting. It's it's excellent for that. So here's what it sounds like about six inches away from the microphone. If I come back here, I'm about 12 inches away from the microphone, maybe a little bit further with excellent noise rejection, as you would expect from a well-built cardioid. It has a nice open sound with a little kiss at the top end, just a little so you can hear that scoop out in the 2.5 to 3K range. It really helps you focus on the detail in the mid range. A little bit of top end saute, you know what I'm talking about? So if I go around the microphone, hello, 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 hello to the back of the microphone. This is what we sound like coming back around, back around, back around, back around to the front, back around to the front. Bo, 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 a little proximity. This is actually, this might be too much. Hello, hello, a little proximity effect. But if that's what you're going for, and now, The Rock Johnson in another jungle movie. You know, you know how it goes. Sounds amazing, sounds amazing on vocals. Like I said, this is going to be my go-to uh, voiceover microphone because I just love it. I've started a deep, passionate romance with this microphone. And I, need, I want you guys to try it because I think you'll like it too, it's particularly if you use it for voiceover work, particularly if you are interested in a microphone for vocals. And I've and I've reviewed a lot of vocal microphones on this channel, but like, but this one is, this one is amongst the elite. That's the Jay-Z Microphones V12. It has such a radio ready sound right out of the box. I love the detailed mid range. I love that smart scoop out in the 2.5 to three kilohertz range. Gets that harsh resonance out of there. Smooth, round, not harsh, top end. Has a particular flavor of sheen that's not found in every mic that I really, really like. On uh, my voice, female vocals voice, sounds fantastic. Little to no distortion, I, I couldn't hear any distortion. It has a full and complete sound that's undeniable for vocals. And from what I'm hearing, it's good on other instruments as well, guitars, drums, you name it. Whatever you decide you wanna throw at it, it sounds great. If you haven't heard of a Jay-Z microphone yet, this is absolutely one you need to have on your radar. This definitely needs to be on your list to audition without question. If you've been following me for a little bit, you've seen my other mic videos. I love other mics. This is top three, easy. I haven't decided a favorite of all of them. I just know that this one is completely in the running. I wanna thank you guys again for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for your support. I will catch you. I'll leave a link in the description below so you can check out the V12. I will catch you on the next video. Peace.